Hey, my sweet nose heart, how are you doing today? Would you like to have a really unique, sweet movement experience today? Well, I've got one for you, a really special one. And as you probably figured it ate out already, we are going to be doing the infinity symbol with our body. Yes, that's right. And it's going to feel awesome. And as usual, this training session is smartly built so your entire body gets a thorough workout. So once again, we've got ourselves a sexy belly dancer sculpting session, a soul soother and a mood uplifter. Let's get started with this. Well, we're gonna start our today's flow by standing together and we're gonna draw a big figure eight with those hands and arms. Crossing in the middle and then circling, opening up, crossing in the middle and circling, opening down. Stretching up and slight plie and ab contraction and chin to the chest as we're crossing the, the hands in the middle. Now we're also gonna stretch on the toes as we open circle those arms up. And a little bit more of a plie, more of an ab contraction, a little bit more chin to the chest now. We're gonna get a little bit more fluent with those finger eights. Let's draw a couple more of them. Stretching nice and big here and keeping weight in the heels as you go in the plie. Excellent. Now we're gonna step it out. Just step and touch. The upper body turn into the side as we step in and here we are also gonna draw a big figure eight with our arms so here we go nice and bouncy to the beat head is looking at the arms the neck is engaged And we're gonna transform this figure eight a little bit, go into the lower body more. So we're gonna contract the side muscles, lift and step on that leg. The arms are keep drawing the big figure eight, contracting, lifting and stepping. Lower body warm up and the pelvic floor warm up with this movement. Nice and thorough. Couple last of those. Let's step together, hands together, keeping the elbows close together. Let's draw a figure eight with our elbows in front of us. Slight bounces, up contraction as the elbows are coming to the middle. Good core and the back warm up with that. Couple more of those figure eights here. All right. And finally, we're gonna draw a figure eight with our legs on the floor in front and at the back, pointing the toes in front and then the heel is working at the back. Supporting ourselves with the arm frame, I mean keeping, creating balance with the arm frame. And now let's lift leg forward with that, with a lifted leg. Last one. Let's warm up the other leg. So just draw it on the floor first. Feel it in my ankles, in my toes, and in the heels. All of the body parts are coming the taste of the sweet movement. And this is just the beginning. This is just the warm up. And it tastes so sweet already. Last three, the leg is lifted. So much better leg muscle warm up with it. All right, and final again. Lift it up slightly, extend back and dive down and just shake the upper body, loosening it up, shaking the head, loosening the neck and bend straight the knees in alternation and then roll up. The bodies are all ready for the sequence one. So in this sequence we're gonna work our lower body. First, we're gonna step out to the side and back center, other side and center. 
Engaged core, we're gonna engage our arms. One hand goes under the chin, the other arm extends to the side diagonally. And this is gonna be our frame for today's figure eight with the lower body. Last one, and we're gonna twist the hips to the side and center. Twist to the side, slide plie and center, straighten. Super engaged core. Twist to the side and now as we twist to the front, we're gonna lift it on the toes. Lifting with the core strength mostly. And keeping that chest as isolated as possible, just working with that middle. And we're gonna do this movement today in a pattern. One, two, three, hold. Front, side, front, hold. Side, front, side, hold. One, two, three, hold. And we're gonna work the other side, so on flat foot first. Twisting to the front, twisting to the side. Keeping a beautiful straight arm frame. And now let's lift on the toes as we twist to the front. So much more of the core and of the lower body work out this way. And twisting, and twisting. And remember our pattern. One, two, three, hold. One, two, three, hold. Front, side, front, hold. Front, side, front, hold. And we're gonna combine both sides. But we're gonna actually have a short break in, in between. I'm gonna adjust my outfit and just to loosen up four bounces, arms side to side. I'm gonna go right back to, into our combination. So the frame and we're gonna twist side, front, side, hold, looking at the hip, changing the arms, front, side, front, hold, and looking at the hip, transferring to the other side already. Looking at the hip and then changing the arms to the front, side, front, and side, front, side, hold, change the arms, front, side, front, hold, looking at the hip, other side, front, side, and change the arms front, side, front. And this is our combination. And looking at the hip, accentuating the movement. Changing the arms, front and side, front, side. We are going a little bit fast already, but you're already probably rocking it. So this is how I sometimes like my figure eight. Have you already done it this way? And you're probably feeling this is a no joke workout. Your middle is on fire probably. If you ain't, you're not focusing enough. So let's work it. Really definite movement of this middle. A little bit faster here. But we're gonna have sh another short break, guys. So remember, there is a fi imagine there is a figure eight on the floor. So we could just we could just walk around this figure eight in our most natural, fun walk, hips side to side, just to loosen up and to relax. Here. And we're gonna go Beyonce style here, really fast. Let's move those arms at the sides up and out and down. So, so just loosen up and revitalized. We're gonna go right back into our combination. So you already know the movements. So our frame and here we go. Twist inside, front, side, front, side, front, other side, front, side, and front, side, front.
And I really like this music by the Ashnaya project. And re really becoming more definite with each repetition of the movements. It's this really divine movement. Alright, so let's just stretch up slightly, extend back, dive down and shake that booty, hands forward, feet back, down facing and just shaking that booty, just shifting the weight side to side, I feel more of the stretch in the back side of the legs, guys. Alright, let's reverse and press the table towards the ground, squeezing the shoulder blades together, opening the chest to the sky and let's take it back to the child's pose. And we're gonna shift the weight side and side, 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 side. Shift and shift, 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 shift. Move and move, sweet, sweet, move. Side and side, almost there. Ready to move into the sequence too. Now it's time to draw a figure 8 with the middle of your chest, but first let's work the range of motion sliding the chest side to side, soft knees engaged, core straight spine, let's work it up and down, the chest lifts, that it also lifts you on your toes, let's slide it diagonally. Working out a big range of motion here. And to the other diagonal. And you probably already figured it out, figured it eight out, what we're gonna do after this. We are gonna go ahead and draw a figure eight with the middle of the chest. So here we go. And you're already feeling it. So many muscles are participating, the upper core muscles the chest, the shoulders, the back and let's make this movement bigger guys bigger figure 8 so big that it lifts us on the toes as it draws the circle out and as it comes to the middle point we land on one leg bending the other knee to the center This also looks really divine, doesn't it? Making it really nice and fluent. And we are gonna speed this up, guys. And remember that pattern from before, one, two, three, hold. One, two, three, hold. One, two, three, hold. And hold. So let's speed this up. On the fourth count we hold. And this pose that we hold is really like the sweetest belly dance figure 8 pose. And yeah, as before, the entire body is working. Your lower body, now your core as we lift in front, before as we did it on flat foot. Just the upper body was participating, but now your entire body, not just the chest. And this is our combination too. And next we're going to put together the first and this one. In one sweet, divine, infinity flow.
but we're gonna have short stretched over to the side before and over to the other side and we're gonna bring the ear to the shoulder bouncing on the knees and roll the shoulders back and let's stretch it up and dive down hands forward feet back downward facing feet shoulder width just stretching the back side of the body let's reverse and squeeze the shoulder blades together open the chest and press the one hip to the ground stretch on the side the other hip to the ground and again change and change press and press let's just play with this how about our pattern one two three hold one two three hold one two three hold one two three hold let's bring it center and just one more good stretch here let's take bring it back walk the hands towards the feet roll up and we are ready and we're gonna dance the combinations one and two three times I'm gonna start with combo one to the right so let's get that frame ready and here we go side front side front side front change side front side front side front and three more times this combination and twist 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 isolate in the upper body and combo two hold one two three hold and let's speed this up figure it eight in it out Let's walk on the figure eight, just loosening up and relaxing. Let's stretch the arms overhead, stretching the hips side to side. Ready to dance the divine interpretation on the figure eight the second time around. So here we go to the right again. Side, front, side, front, side, front. This time around a little bit slower and twist 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 let's work this two more times to the front and changing the side ready for the combo two Hold and hold as well a little bit slower this time around not gonna speed this up so we're gonna walk on the figure eight loosening up and relaxing after the second interpretation so, stretch, a big stretch of those hips side to side. Ready for the final dance off. This is gonna be your best one. You know everything now. So well, so here we go. So how are we liking those figure eights today? Well, with figure eight, just as the symbol itself is there are infinite possibilities so this workout is definitely just the first one in the series there are gonna be more because infinite 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 sweet movement experiences You've done this amazingly. So final figure eight walk. And let's uplift ourselves with a figure eight. Let's come on the releve.
it is time for a stretch and cool down. Let's stretch up and slightly extend back and dive down. Hands forward, feet back, downward facing. Push yourself off of the ground and let's shift the hips side to side for a deeper stretch on the back side of the legs. Let's do one, two, three, hold. Side, 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 hold. One, two, three, hold. Shift, 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 hold. One, two, three. And let's bring the center and press the table towards the ground. Reverse upward facing and squeezing the shoulder blades together, opening the chest to the sky. I'm also gonna drive my toes towards my crown and you can do it with me, pressing the tailbone into the ground, squeezing the shoulder blades together. This stretch makes me really ecstatic, you know that too. And let's release. We'll get ourselves on all fours, guys, and we're gonna open the pelvic to the side, the pelvic, pelvic floor to the sides and then release, relax the muscles, then open them, then relax. Stretch open to the side, release, stretch, release, stretch, release, and stretch, release. Those muscles were just contracted by pressing the table towards the ground, we just stretch to the side. Now let's bring to the child's pose. Lift the upper body, we are going to sit and open our legs, tilt the tailbone back, straight spine, we're gonna make the figure eight movement with our arms. Bring the upper body forward as we cross in the arms in the middle. Enjoy the stretch across the inner thighs of the legs, the pelvic muscles. Nice and soft and fluent. All right, let's bring those legs together. Tuck one toe under, tilt the tailbone front to feel more stretch across the front side of the leg and let's draw the figure eight with the tailbone guys for even a deeper stretch on all of the sides of the leg other leg now here we go let's draw the figure eight with our tailbone And we're gonna release. We're gonna sit and extend our legs in front. I decided now, actually. Now I decide, let's extend our legs in front. Flex the feet, grab them, straight spine, and let's drive the upper body towards our legs with the abdominals. The back side of the legs is enjoying the deep stretch now. Let's just rock side to side. Shifting with that tailbone side to side. Okay, let's release. Thank you for working out with me. Thank you for watching. Give this workout thumbs up. Sh come back to this. Share this with your friends. Spread the love. And we're going to see ourselves.